What's up, good people? This is your homeboy, Pastor Earl, coming at you live and direct from Abyssinian Missionary Baptist Church in the Windy City of Whitehaven, and I am bringing you some information that you straight up need to know. Uh, we hope that you are having a fun-filled and spirit-filled weekend, and that you're also considering your spiritual and faith-based responsibilities. Get out and vote, and vote no on Amendment 1, but also uh, this weekend, we hope that you would take some time to uh, go to a house of worship this Sunday. And an excellent place to be would be Abyssinian Missionary Baptist Church, 3890 Mill Branch. This Sunday, we are lifting up the theme of breast cancer awareness. As many of you know, October recognizes a lot of uh, issues and situations that are going on in our communities. But one of them is breast cancer awareness. So we want everybody to come to Abyssinian as we lift up that theme of breast cancer awareness. We're asking that everybody wear something pink. Uh, I've been struggling with that for a long time, so maybe I'll put on a pink ribbon or something like that. But we want you to know that uh, Sunday school starts at 9 a.m. Our worship service starts at 10 o'clock, and we're inviting everybody. I'm going to be preaching a sermon that talks about uh, sisters who have been victimized by and also have become victorious over breast cancer. I'm preaching something entitled, the testimony of my scars. Or I may call it my good side. I don't know yet, but you definitely don't want to miss that. That's 10 o'clock Sunday morning at Abyssinia. Also, Sunday evening at Abyssinia at 6 o'clock for the second time in two years, there will be a concert hosted by Brother Mike Mosby and the Hard Hitters. It's called A Family That Prays. Many of you may know about the Mosby family. They're a family full of musically gifted uh artists and ministerial individuals so last year they had a concert at Abyssinia and they're having it again this year so that's October 26th that's tomorrow Sunday at 6 p.m. it'll be here at Abyssinia and they'll have uh, one of Mike Mosby's nephews uh, Makai Mosby that brother is a young phenom he is gifted for real anointed for real Maurice Mosby will be performing special guest artist Latoya Strong Malone is gonna be there Pastor Ella Mosby is going to be there. It's going to be some wonderful people doing some wonderful things. So you don't want to miss that. And the concert is free. I think they'll take up an offering at some point just to uh, benefit uh, Raising the Bar Community Development Ministry, which Mike Mosby has founded. So don't miss that. Lastly, um, we have a wonderful banquet coming up. The Abyssinian Missionary Baptist Church Anniversary Banquet. Abyssinian is celebrating nine years of faithful and fruitful ministry this year. So on November the 7th at 7.30 p.m. at Soul Cafe, which is located at 3557 Ridgeway Road in Hickory Hill, we will have our second annual anniversary banquet. Uh, our mistress of ceremony will be K97's own radio personality, Ina Esco. We will also have some wonderful food and some special music. Maurice Mosby, who I mentioned earlier, will be rendering music at the banquet. And our keynote speaker is my good brother and friend and fraternity brother, the Reverend, soon to be Reverend Dr. Cedric Von Jackson, who is the senior pastor of Mount Zion Baptist Church in Sardis, Mississippi. The tickets for the banquet are $40 a piece and $200 for a table. So you need to be reserving it because the tickets are going fast, space is going fast, it is going to sell out, it's going to probably be uh, capacity, so if you don't get yours soon, you're going to end up being left out. But please consider all of these announcements, don't miss worship tomorrow at Abyssinian, don't miss the concert uh, tomorrow evening at 6 p.m. at Abyssinian, and don't miss the Abyssinian Baptist Church anniversary banquet. All these things are going to be some things that continue to uplift our community and our people. So I want to see you at all of those places. It's your homeboy, Pastor Earl, signing out. In the meanwhile, meet me, in, meet me on Facebook, meet me on Twitter, meet me on Instagram, but get out and vote and vote no on Amendment 1 in Tennessee. Peace.